Hey folks, this is Noble Rambler, and welcome back to RimWorld. I played the game for a few minutes between last episode and this to get some, some piddly little stuff done. Like the granite blocks brought over to a few spaces over here and there to fill in voids, and, and assign orders for everybody. Though I've noticed something, and we saw that last time, but now we're seeing it in action, that this disease that they have got causes tiredness of plus 70%, so they're going to sleep off and on through the day, and which is going to mess up their sleep schedule, because they're right now filling up on sleep, and they're going to be waking up, like Klaus, for instance, needs, he'll be probably awake at you know, 3 in the morning and start his day, and by noon he'll be tired again, and so it's going to be kind of off and on for them. Otherwise, they're grabbing meals, I got a whole bunch of wood brought over and dropped off into blueprints, Tomislav is grabbing the last of it to put over in here and then he is going to need some food and sleep next yeah in fact I thought he had done that already so I guess I need to clear this to see if it gets done did not so let's clear it okay anybody else in trouble those who do not have it are these three right here Kathra, Sangria and Natalia everybody else is asleep except Tomislav he's going to get a meal then he's going to conk out and We'll see him tomorrow. <clears throat> Otherwise, what? Went through the gauntlet. They've got almost all of it built now. So we're going to pull out that square. Going to come through here, get rid of the door. I could hold the door open, but I don't know what that's going to do to their sense of a free flow pathway into the base. As soon as there's a door that restricts it, then they change their mind and create new patterns, new, new pathing. So I'm going to get rid of the door there. Go across here, get rid of the door there. It's going to go through here and travel its way out. I'm going to set new stockpiles in here to get more of the... Uh, that's interesting. Oh, it's marble. That's why. Um, these over here are limestone. So limestone chunks are going to go in all of these except for the ends where the traps are going to go. So they can walk in a door, lean over, reset traps, and then go through. That's the plan. Um, what else? just about done in here except for that piece but I believe we're considered uh, indoors right uh, indoors 45 degrees so still have some heating issues we haven't got uh, I had them just hauling things so I didn't really get any mining done we do have 34 steel over there but I did set a a heater in here um, we are at 60 degrees and these guys are good until let's see here gear good until negative 34 wow and negative 17 okay uh that's a cloth toque and a parka oh they got parkas and that one has got a duster okay so negative 34 with a parka we're at negative 6 17 so i'm guessing it also has to do with the materials that they're made out of so 17 but it's all cloth whereas zoya here has got a mega sloth wool Duster. Whoa. So there's a reason to tame a mega sloth. Get another source of wool like the, the, uh, oh, muffalos and the alpaca. I wonder if the different wool sources have different qualities to them, different uh, temperature ranges, depending on the kind of wool. Be interesting to find out. Otherwise, what am I hearing? I think I'm hearing sewing going on. You can see it right there. So Natalia's sewing. Everybody else has Z's next to him except Shantigo, who just got done with his afternoon nap, and he's ready to start his day. To do what? Relax socially. And I'm going to let them... Oh, no, it's 1 in the morning. Hmm. Why did he get a trigger to relax at 1 in the morning? Hmm. He doesn't need it. He's not going to gain any more from it. What he's going to gain more from is just to grab a meal. So why don't you consume a fine meal and call that your... Your joy. Handy is relaxing socially. Interesting. Handy. You guys are almost maxed out. Huh. I can't really explain that. But I'm going to say... Uh, how about hauling some wood for fun? That could be That could be cool. Yeah. <laughs> I can be a slave master while they've got this disease. I can get as much done as I possibly can. At least for the ones that let me. These two right here, they, they've got a mind of their own. Tell them to haul something, they just look at you and stare. <laughs> anyway, so... What else did I do? So I set a heater in there, 
and out in here we are at 63 degrees we're kind of okay for this weather we're still into september which is fall so when we get into winter we're going to need more heaters going so that's probably more the priority of where this steel's got to go to rather than you know if i wanted to i could set a cooler right there for the refrigerator and just get that void filled as we go through this what was that going oh, that's going to be um, a block wall okay so that's all block wall through there not this one that's a doorway cancel that that is what is that though no that's not a that is a wall okay so structure granite wall yeah you can kind of put that back in there thank you um this is the doorway cutting right through the the uh, solar panels right into a door right there four-way door a four door a four door with a four-way four door thing intersection like this one over here we can't see it either because only one door is built but there's a door there there and there same sort of thing here boom 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 and during the summertime we will open all three and close that one or, do, or leave that one normal but set these guys to stay open heat will travel on out of the the various ways to for the heat to exhaust this, this exhaust duct here as well as leave this open as a pathway to go into the freezer and then during the winter time we'll shut that one down nobody can go through shut that down nobody can go through and this will just be a heat pathway through here so they'll never be walking up this pathway even though they have access because the doors will be shut down there'll be nowhere to go a new recruit so klaus has successfully recruited justin jump to location and Justin is getting rid of that hat and hauling it. Nice. All right. <laughs> Who's Justin? Character. We'll find out next episode who Justin's going to become. But right now she is a cave world tunneler and an escaped convict. Ooh, exciting. Can social a little bit. Wants to, to train animals at some point. Can is fairly close to being a uh, you know a low-level cook, and can mine like crazy, and doesn't say cannot. Um, I just noticed something cannot uh, do dumb labor. So is right now our hauler is abrasive and a night owl. So Justin is going to be spending a lot of time with Natalia. So another abrasive with, uh, yeah, that, that's going to be some. It's going to we're going to have some interesting. Uh, events come out of that <laughs> anyway klaus good job zoya you are not zoya justin is carrying a cloth toque and removing a cloth toque so you, oh you want to trade i think you want to trade for for another one okay so let's just quickly in fact i don't need to have this pause there's nothing critical critical going on set your priorities cannot doctor okay warden Nope. So just a four. Handle, not for any near future. Cook, um, a four for now. We'll deal with training that up some other time. Hunting is a no. Construction is a no. Though I can have you haul some building materials in. That's what the four is for. Grow, four out of 20. That's going to lose some crops, but that is still doable. So I'll make that one a two for when that's really necessary. Your one, though, is going to be mining. So Justin right there, that is your one. Otherwise, pine cut, everybody gets to do it. And you could do that one as well, but there's a lot of mining to do. I think I'll just get you started. Art, you have a little skill and you have a little interest. So we'll set that one as a two, and we'll readjust those if it ever happens. Minor break risk, Michael. Um, hauling is up there too, although I could get you just directly mining, and you'll like it. Hmm. With a lot of passion. Okay. So we'll leave you at a two there and a two there, but yeah, we'll figure all those out later. Uh, that means Rabbit doesn't have to be nonstop mining. That you don't want him to because as soon as that greenhouse gets built he's going to be back into growing so grow is right there and then your plant cutting is next and then your mining is next after hunting yeah that all looks pretty good and doctoring after before all those yep okay do that michael where are you uh right there click on you you needs 
are quite low because of what? Hmm, moderate amount of pain, and that's probably going to go up. It's going to escalate as we get closer to uh, uh, the end of this disease, which I believe lasts for 20 days. So 10 treatments every two days for 20 days. Now, what to do with Michael? He is wearing an alpaca. Okay, cutting stone blocks from chunks. Grabbing chunks and you're doing all this in a very ugly environment, which is what's tanked your beauty. So that's hurting right there. Comfort, an awful chair. Well, we can fix that one right now. I, you know, I probably could have you do this. Let's, hmm, uninstall. And Michael, you could do it right now just to get it done. We're going to uninstall that. As soon as that's, hmm, I can't get you to move it though. One thing I can really do is get you to reinstall it somewhere. So let's change that, because I can't make you haul, but I can trick you into reinstalling it right here in the stockpile. So why don't you do that instead? There. Then once it's out of there, I get somebody else to build it. In fact, I can even have Michael haul the, uh, the, the wood over to build it. Right there. No, I can't, because I can make him construct. I think that's what I can do. Um, chair. We could go and find a really good one, or I can just have Handy do it, and odds are pretty good that it'll happen. Normal chair. Let's see if we get better than normal. So with that, actually, that's all boxed up. If I get him over here, stop him before he starts, right there. Oh, you're so quick. I could have you uninstall and actually right there. Do that one real quick. All right. What? Justin, no, 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 no. You're not sleeping down there in the in the in the marble bed okay justin gets to sleep hmm that's natalia never reset that one justin i guess you are kind of natalia's gonna want to crash here real soon in fact i don't see natalia she's already crashed somewhere she is over here <laughs> Here in Sangria's bed. <laughs> the one where Sangria's heading to. Then let's do that. This is now um, Justin. Right there. And this is now Natalia. Where are you at? Right there. And that gets her out of there. Unhappy nudity, somebody, Justin. So we got to figure that out. And Justin is digging at granite. Okay, what's with your gear? You are wearing a t-shirt and a bowler hat. Well, there's pants over here, right? Right there. So come wear these. Force wear those. Superior pants. And then <clears throat> you, gear, need to then force wear a... Hmm... There's a parka, really low quality, looking for a duster right there. After that, you can forswear Justin. A mega sloth duster. Mega sloth leather duster this time instead of wool. And let's see, restrict, assign, anything. Justin is now going to be ranged, I think, right? I didn't actually check that character. You're neither. You're probably in the end going to be a melee, meaning let's get you, let's get a shield on you because yeah, I don't know. I think I probably should. If we do get any shields, we we'll want to save those for the ones who really are melee, who are really going to need it. Okay, well, let's watch Justin for a moment. Now I'll figure out what it is I was doing. So you went for the bowler hat. That's not going to keep you warm. But are you happier now? You're now wearing a cloth toque because you like that one all the way up there just slightly better okay let's get somebody to tear these down whatever happened here we need to Michael we need to get the wood haul to that chair then I'll have handy build it Natalia just went to bed good and Sangria is now assigned to here is that the step I missed it is so Sangria you're now there and let's get a fire going in here. Temperature, campfire, right there. There's a vent in between, but there's a door blocking the vent. I didn't think about that. 
I wonder. I'm curious about something. If we look at the beauty in this room, we're at a negative 0.3. Shantigo, stay there. Uh, the medicine is a negative 4 in and of itself. So if I were to have this door held open, Shantigo, go right there. Uh, draft. Go right there through the door. Thank you. And then undraft. So it was a negative 0.3. Beauty here is a zero now. He must have just done did something to the room that changed something. Oh well. I don't know if okay, if if the if storage is in the room, it detracts from its beauty. So if you build it into a separate space like we did the cloth and everything to get it away from this, you see all the negative 20s and 35s in there, although there's a lot of dirt here, but then it won't count toward the room. If I have the door open, I'm still thinking it's counting that as its own little room, so it's no longer, it's still not being part of this room. In fact, you can see right there the blue surrounding it right there is showing what is the room even though that door is open. With that door open, we should still get temperature moving through. Eh, theoretically, we'll see how that works. But we need to get that campfire built before nighttime. We need to get probably one more campfire built before nighttime because I don't see a. S well, it's possible we could have a built. Where are we at? We're only eight in the morning. If I can remember to get Justin assigned down there, Justin right now is tapping away at that one. Let's let you just finish right there. Let's now you're not storage, Justin needs you're fine okay including your food <clears throat> let's get you straight over here and to work now i don't know if she's going to make it there there's still the dis distance issue of her getting from there to about here and then changing her mind and going off to work on something over there still got some raw fungus over here refrigerated it's cold in there look at handy's just flying through here all right you are building everything that had material brought to it good so let's make actually what are our beds poor normal shoddy normal well eventually we need to go through and rebuild everything you know now that handy's really getting her skill built up just have her go through and problem is that we when we do that we're going to need to unassign everybody to from construction except for handy so we know that the best skill is going to be building everything but handy you are building that once you build this one it'll give a boost to this room build the dresser okay justin i want to kind of babysit your pathway in here right there you're still heading this direction ah right there she just recalculated now she's going over here and i would love to have the silver done but i really need steel so let's try to keep you going over here so she got from there to there pause and recalculated changed her mind who we got now shantigo so he was having a little bit of problem before he's got character neurotic so his mental break threshold is eight percent more difficult okay so shantigo is right now needs about to need some rest his beauty is there's, there's nothing pretty in, in this base right now how's his room you're right here. You got a construction project that is not completed, and that's going to. No, the materials haven't been brought. But we could certainly get some cleaning done. Justin, can you clean? You can clean. Just, I'm going to divert you real quick. Right there, let's clean up Shantigo's room real fast. Beauty here, negative one, positive one, and there's no more dirt. Okay, now, Justin back on track over here okay so somebody on cleaning detail would actually be a good idea keep the beauty up as much as possible who it'd have to be one of the three that aren't affected by this disease that are going to end up hurting themselves by doing it so Kathra, natalia will not and sangria and needs your beauty's rough. Your mood is there, Kathra. Kind of the same. Hmm. Kathra's making a sculpture. And she's doing something that she likes, and it's joy for her right now. Okay. Is there anybody who could like cleaning? Is that 
Is that ever a thing? Work clean right there. No, it's just like hauling. There are no passions whatsoever. Okay, so... Hmm. Alright, still watching Justin Shantigo. You're in a cleaning mood. Let's have you just grab a meal. That's going to help boost your your mood. Just going to feed you guys until you put on 10 pounds while you've got this disease. Justin, are you going to make it there? That I'm curious about. Let's zoom out a little bit while I can still stare at everybody else. Let's see. Michael is over there. He's going to have a major clean issue here. Nope. Justin just recalculated. Try that again. All right. I think you can make it this time. By then, you're going to want... We're going to be at 1,400. In fact, speaking of 1,400, mental rest, Shantigo. Yeah, mental break. I changed the, that second joy hour to the end of the day. Figured as they get to the very end, they're going to get their joy up, grab a meal or whatever, and then get a long sleep. All those combined are going to give them a, a big mood boost. In the middle of the day, I would have pushed it back a little bit. We've already established the 14, and it works well with the, the night owl's schedule. Was It was Justin, right? Uh, or was it... Or was I reading Zoya? Character... I know. Yep, it was Justin. Okay, so I'm going to give you the same schedule as Natalia. Though you won't necessarily be in the same room as each other throughout the day. Um, restrict and anything for Justin. All right, through there and there. And Justin does not have this disease, so let's put your sleep right in there. That should do it. You'll start in there somewhere and you'll finish whenever your rest runs out. There must still be times when you are up when you would rather be sleeping and get a negative for a little while but not too much um health no you the disease didn't move into the jail it just affected our colonists all right you are there now okay who can i bug over here natalia's sleeping for the day so Tomislav, you are building wooden chair i would love to see handy do that so um Tomislav, you can clean and you kind of like it Theoretically, with your, uh, what am I doing here? Work. With your your job description, you prefer to see things nice and tidy. You know what happens when germs go rampant. So let's divert you to beautifying. Hmm. Let's go to beauty. Is there dirt right there too? Is that why it's 43? Could be. Let's just get you triggered. Clean blood. Okay. Do that. Great. You're in cleaning mode. All right. Now, as soon as Handy's done with this, right there, you are going to go build that chair. Right there. Boy, it's nice to see Handy doing nothing. That didn't work. Uh, okay. Why? Because somebody finished it. Oh, it's over there. I'm at the wrong table. Handy. All right. Handy. I can't right click now. I cannot right click. Michael, draft, go here. Handy. There we go. Michael, do whatever you like. Okay, let's get this built and let's see what it actually turns out to be. Dining chair. Where'd you go? <laughs> Handy. I cannot do anything when Michael is standing there. You're going to go here. Right there, Handy, you are going to do that. And Michael, you're just going to sit there and watch. And chairs take a long time. I've noticed that. They take longer than about any other piece of furniture in the game. Four little pieces of wood. All right. You are superior. All right. Michael, have a blast with that. Get your comfort, like, way up there. Needs... Michael, comfort, look at that. It's just flying. It's heading all the way to there. And it's going to send this up in there, too. He'll grab a meal that'll help out more. Then he'll grab a rest, and that'll top him off. Great. Tomislav, how you doing? Well, you're unnaturally high in, in your mood all the time. So, yeah, you're the perfect cleaner for this job. Great. Okay, Justin's going to bed. Night Owl. Natalia is going to bed. Handy's going to bed just because she's sick. And that's why she quit that one. She went for rest. Okay. Um, so, 
just didn't went to bed because of a night owl. I finally got her over there, and she accomplished nothing. <laughs> okay. We need to find some clothes or steel. That's what it comes down to. Would love, though, to get... If we're going to mine something, let's mine out our base. But, because otherwise the next steel that's convenient isn't convenient. It's down in this area. In fact, there was something else I was going to queue up and didn't. Right over there. Orders, mine out, something like that group there. Okay, so who's not sleeping? Klaus, you are resting. Anything you can do on the way in? How desperate are you? You're kind of desperate. Okay, let's go for a meal on the way in. Right there. That way, that particular bar is not waiting eight more hours to uh, get even worse. Okay. Um, Tomislav. There you are. You're still cleaning dirt. Your needs, you're fine. You do have this, yeah. But you're just kind of not on the same sleep cycle as all the rest of them. Okay. Um, and you're cleaning, so I'm not going to do anything with you. But let's kind of run through here. Rabbit, you are resting because you need it. Rabbit, where are you right now? Whenever they go to do something, now well, you're already there. I'd love to be able to catch them and send them to do something else. Like Klaus, maybe bring in this meat on your way to get that meal. Now, are you still going to get a meal? You're not. So it didn't save that other order. Sometimes it does and sometimes it doesn't. Oh, I didn't hit uh, shift. No, they would have done it afterward, though. Hmm. Okay. Drop you there. Well, I'll leave you alone so you can say hi. You're going to grab a meal, and you're fine. Okay. Tomislav, you do not need a meal. Okay, who else we got? Sangria. Is that here? Working with what? Uh, just going for a walk. Okay. I can't have you train. Cannot train. Tame Boomalope. Animal interacted too recently. So Sangria instead is still going to go for a walk. Okay. So the animals, she, she, there's a timer involved with taming. Taming and training. They can, she can only do it at certain points of the day. Thomas Slav is playing horseshoes. He needs some joy. All right, Cathra, where are you and what are you up to? Relaxing socially? Just finishing your 1400. Hmm. What could I have you do? Let's get this cleaned up a little bit for Sangria. So floors, wood, right there. And you needs your joy is tanked. Let's go, or maxed, we'll put it that way. You're going to do that. Grab some wood and come back over. <clears throat> Natalia's up. She's up. And she's going to go make a duster. You finished that duster. Okay. And then it got used, so we're still below, still behind one duster. And was there someone else to do the sewing. What did we decide last time? It had to do with Michael, maybe? Somehow it got her researching again, and then they went away. What was I thinking of? So research two is really Tomislav and Natalia. Something freedom to talk. I guess at that time we had no, no no clothes to deal with. I think that's what it what was going on. Right now we just have the duster. This one too? Uh, this one. Just the duster. So we'll get that one duster done. Sienna's hauling food in. Nice. Now here's something that's interesting. Well, never mind. It's 50 of 50, so there's no change. I had seen once, um, in between episodes, when I ran it for a little bit, that there was a, say, a stack, and it was like 46 of 50. And spoils in one day. And then we brought another one over that was a little bit spoiled, like a, you know, 49 of 50. And it actually took the average of them, took it down to like 48. So it wasn't necessarily just the, the uh, characteristics of the meal that got dropped, but it, it did kind of merge the piles together. So that, that sounds a little bit more fair. All right, who we got? Sangria is right here. She is taking kibble. She's going to go do some more training. Is there anything more we could be doing with Sangria right now? I think her fallback was hauling, right? Uh, work, Sangria, once you're... Oh, growing. And then plant cutting. And then, oh, hauling is your first. 
I see. So we're going to handle then haul. Those are both ones right now. Okay. Who's about? Minor break risk, Klaus and Shantigo. Let's go look at them. Though I think they're both sleeping it off. Shantigo. Going to have to really pay attention to the, the needs of these six for a while. So he's heading to here once his rest is done. Then when we take up his food, he's going to be a little bit further up to about there. So this is where some players would resort to adding drugs to the... Uh, to the formula. It's easier just to quickly give them a toque on a marijuana joint or something and get their mood up. Or or personally, I would use chocolate or something, but uh, give them a quick mood boost. And it, it, it satisfies the problem of the moment. Of course, it is, there's a good risk of them getting addicted to it, and then you have to provide it. Otherwise, they go through the withdrawal symptoms afterwards, which compounds the, the mood issues and makes it worse than the original problem. So that's why I prefer just to stay away from the, stay away from them. Um, these got built. Okay. Need a light in here. I thought about maybe making this a quick little wedding chapel while we're waiting. Well, I guess once this bed is built, hmm. We have one more possible recruit coming soon. One more possible bed soon. And then we're, we're at the point of two people per room. This will eventually be another two people. Hopefully by then, we will have built some of this and maybe even got some bedrooms going in here and start working on the rest of it. But for the moment, if we can get them to build all this, Handy, you are building wooden floor. Okay, but you've got a great run speed right now. Let's bring wood for here. Oh, but you've got, well, at least it's 48 wood. I was hoping you'd go for a stack of 75 with your run speed. Anyway, time to micromanage you guys. Shantigo, you are out here cleaning dirt. So, how are our meals? 50. 27. Okay. Need to get you back into cooking. We dumped that to do something else and need to get you back in onto your normal routine. So, Shantigo right there. Cooking's back to a 1. And then cleaning is your backup. Okay, that works. And this has been reloaded. Shantigo, right click. Prioritize refueling. So bring some, some more wood. And let's get somebody else to reload. Well, we kind of are. There's 75 here. Uh, spoils in three quadrums. And over here, mega soft meat spoils in less than a day. It is 1900. Actually, Shantigo, just, let's just go straight to work cooking. Did I do it wrong? Yeah, cook. There we go. In fact, let's clear you and make sure that that's not a problem and try one more time. Okay, let's get that meat used up before it goes bad right there on the right there in the stockpile. <clears throat> Otherwise, we are getting some of this hauled in. That's good. The stuff is starting to break down. Yeah, out there outside. Bug meat, does it go bad? It kind of does. Spoils in a day. All right, Handy, you are bringing wood to floor... Oh, you got all that done. Well, let's get more of this done. Handy. Yeah, you're selected. And you're going for wood over here this time. What was that? Successfully tamed a wild boar. Okay, so animals. We've now got three wild boars, which will all be on their way to obedience and release and rescue and haul. Okay, that's the plan for all those. And we'll assign them temporarily to the alpaca air, grazing area. And it means they'll all have access to the inside, which is where we've got hay stored. When we get cold enough, there's no more grass out here. Well, I'm assuming they can eat the grass out here. I've seen them, you know, the animals just stop and munch, munch, and then it goes to a dirt area when it's done. I don't know if they eat the brambles. No, this brambles are new to me. That's I wasn't in alpha 13 so I've never been bored enough to just kind of sit there and and watch these guys munching on a whatever wandering wandering speaking of bored let's just take a peek around and see what new we definitely have a, a deer herd here and I think I'm gonna wait until we've got a uh, uh, a functioning gauntlet <laughs> before I do that again cargo pods going where Wow. 
another one? Ghost Sangria. All right. No, is that the same one? Wait a minute here. Animals. We just got another one. Okay, we're done with the wild boars for a while. All right. Let's intentionally. What what landed first? We got Hyperweave. Ooh, good stuff. Not a lot of it. We got enough. Got even for. Maybe we, have, we might have enough for a toque. That's about it. Sangria. Let's have you. Uh, first of all, do that. Sangria. You clicked? Yeah. Haul these in. All right. No more wild boars. Four is enough. I haven't checked to see if they're male or female or whatever, but we need to get working on some other things. It'd be nice to get a boomal or two. Right there. You are now hunt instead of tame. Hunt. Okay. Any others in here? Let's zoom out and double click. That's it. It's not counting that one because it's not wild. No, it's wild boar. So I double click here. No, it's definitely a different entity than the other. And nothing else in here. These are all marked. Oh, we have another alpaca. Okay, we'll tame you as well. Okay. So run that one. She's going to take care of that. Yeah, last time I was watching these guys and I've seen their their babies. I've seen the, the boomalope babies. And they look just like a tiny little boomalope. So I had that in my mind. I saw that and I thought, oh. Boom, little baby. No, that's a that's a boom rat. So that was a uh, little brain fart there. Anyway, kind of want to make sure that we truly do not have any more cougars out here, or any other. I'll get we'll get grizzlies on a map like this. I'm not seeing anything. Anything is dangerous. All right. All normal kind of stuff. Got a squirrel. Dead for two days. Missing body parts. Still fresh. Spoils in two days. Something attacked it. Probably the fox. This one? Spoils in four days. Yeah, the fox has been eating out here. I'm thinking this guy. Though I don't know if the raccoon will act as one as well. Sleeping. Um, small, hardy animal that ranges wide across forest and shrubland. Eats almost anything. So, raw meat versus the fox. Does it designate that he is a predator? A small solitary canine evolved for hunting small prey in temperate climates. So, corpses, raw meat. So, I guess because hunting is in the description. And it's not in the description of the raccoon. Otherwise, what else is on our map? We've got possibly a ancient danger. So something buried in the mountain there. I haven't walked over to to get the the warning message or not that so and so you know felt this this ominous feeling over there that there's something wrong with that place. You know one of those kind of messages. I am not seeing any kind of a predator. I'm not seeing any buffalo either. That's also what I'm looking for. I get one or two of those. Though we have to feed the beast too. At that point, we would probably have to set a lot more, uh... Ah, we, are we roofed? Click away... Not roofed, okay. So we've got to get a roof on here. Handy, you are where right now? You're sleeping again. Because it is 2200, or because you need it? I'm... Mm. If I wake you up, you get a negative 3 tacked onto your your score. I don't want to do that. You're with Natalia, who's not going to come in, so there's no chance of either of you waking each other up. So I better just leave that alone. So, Tomislav, you are in... You're grabbing a meal, and otherwise your rest is fine. And you can build. How much cleaning is left to do? Not seeing any. I think you've done a really good job here. There's a one here and there, and you're going to wake everybody up doing it. Okay, let's turn that off. Tomislav, work. Back off of cleaning. We'll let Shantigo do that if necessary. Take you down to a two. Let's put your construction back up to a one. And let's get the greenhouse finished as soon as you're done with that meal. And Shantigo, let's get your work area set up. You needs... You need to eat. Okay, I can't do that yet. Um... 
thought you would have gone for a meal. You didn't. Well, what, have you, what are you actually holding? You're holding just five. Now, why don't you grab a meal? And when that's done, grab the 75. I guess you're going to have to grab and haul these. Okay. Good. And then you can do the 75. Okay, right there. Still can't. Pause. Okay. So, again, Sean Tigo. Why can I not haul? That space is open. Somebody else has got the order, apparently. Okay, then can you bring 75 corn? You can do that. Now can I get you to do it? Now I can get you to do it. Oops. Okay, hold the shift down. And now I can't get you to do the other one. Ha! <laughs> there it is. There is definitely a timer that, that you've got to wait for before you can give them another command. That is really odd to have to uh, reason my way through that. You expect it to be instantaneous. All right, so Shantigo is set to go. Break risk, Shantigo. Now, beauty in this area is doing pretty good. Got the plants over here. Yeah, I can't do much better. So Shantigo right there needs... You're just on that cusp. Not a whole lot more I can do for you. Not really. We can try to get more beauty in here. Cathra was kind of working on that, wasn't she? Um, you're down over... There's no sculpture waiting. Did you sneak another one in? I didn't see it again. You tend to do that. There's a chair. There's a sculpture. We got a normal one. Ooh. And it is a beauty of 68. Ooh. Okay. What do we have here? So, Cathra's newest work is called Orange Still. This sculpture bears an illustration of Laura Sangria holding an armful of toques while standing next to Dela Arroway. Hmm, who is Dela Arroway? Let's come right back to this. I think, unless that is a character in the history of this world, um, Dela. Wait a minute, who? No, that's Zoya. Who's Dela? That's Zoya. So does Dela show up? Here's Klaus. Um, character. Where's a good picture of the name? I guess the name's... That would be character. But the original five only have one name. I was able to do that. Um, this one. So is there a Dela in here? No. So I don't know what that means. Let's look at that again. There. Art. All right. Holding an armful of toques, that's Sangria, while standing next to Dela Arroway, who is completely naked while others look on. Dela is fondling a shrub. There is a cockroach behind the focal point, while the image seems to express goodwill. This depiction refers to Sangria stripping Dela. Oh, it was an enemy on the 6th of September, 5500. Okay. Okay, that, that's just that's just odd. <laughs> it's odd enough that um, we need to put it somewhere. <laughs> Wedding thing, or we build that there. But for right now, it could definitely give a boost to Shantigo. And install that right here. And, you know, it really needs to you know be somewhere where everyone can see it. Yeah. Sangria, since it's of you, then once you finish that meal, like I think I can hold down the shift and have you do that. Did you finish the meal? Or was that just the exact timing? It worked. Okay, minor break risk of Shantigo. So this should help out Shantigo. Since he's... Well, he and Michael are... Michael? You have the negative 12? Am I remembering that right? Michael, character, depressive. Yeah, negative 12. So those two are going to have issues with depression or mood swings during this uh, this disease okay now where am I at 45 minutes into this and I need to get the last of this place built and get the hmm Justin are you up you are and get the heat 
lamp or the sun lamp built and the heater built and get this warmed up, lit up, and get this everything growing before all this new sewing goes away. So first thing is going to be work on that. And hopefully you go somewhere where you bring a whole load of wood in. You will. Good. All right, so there's that. Tomislav, you are hauling wood to wooden wall. Wish I knew exactly which one. Let's specifically tell you to do reserve by handy. Do that group there. Okay. All right, and Justin, track you down. Your meals are fine. You are digging at compacted machinery. Oh, it's going to be a long trip of... Oh, wait a minute. What are you? You're compacted steel, and you're close enough to accept the order and do it. Why don't you go there? We need to get materials dropped off here, too. You're forgetting about that. That one, and then further down into here, we need to block this one. But then we also need to block it over here and block it over here. There's all kinds of pathways up this river to get into us. So eventually we'll seal that all up. Well, with doors, so that we can at least use it. Alright. This didn't get done. It's angry. What happened to you? You went to bed. <sighs> okay. Shantigo, let's fix your own environment here. Okay. That. Zoya's there. Natalia, Michael, Justin made it. Alright. So in that case, let's let these guys seal the perimeter and get the roof built. Somebody fill that hole in. Nobody's going to fill that hole in. Handy got it? Handy's got it. Okay. Fill this in. Specifically, let's get this sealed. Go from there to there to that one. No, no, I'm not letting you go. There you go. But you are insisting on doing these. <laughs> you are what? You want to play horseshoes. Three in the morning. <laughs> Go for it. <laughs> All right, who else is who else can I bug? Rabbit, you are harvesting poplar tree. I said two things for hunting. You didn't go for it, so I've taken you off of hunting, haven't I? Rabbit, grow is first. Plant cut is next, and then hunts after that. Okay. Um, sure. A psychic soothe, please. Let it be for males. Of the female gender. Hmm. Every colonist of the female gender smiles with content. Some distant engine of happiness is stirring. It is projecting a powerful psychic drone over the entire region on a frequency that only seems to affect the female gender. For a few days, some people's moods will be quite a bit better. Well, I'll take it and be thankful. All right. Handy is putting the roof on. Okay, so we need the... Furniture, sun lamp, right there. And then I need a heater. Heater, that is temperature, right in a corner would be best. You're already there. Really? That's a power switch. Okay. The sun lamp, though it doesn't. The miscellaneous. The orbital trade beacon has something you can click on and it will bring up this outline again. But the sun lamp does not, unfortunately. Furniture. So if you look at it, we kind of miss the corners. So the corners are not going to grow as well because they're not going to have the direct uh, light output in those areas. So if you're going to add anything else to the room, that's where you want to put them. We have a switch right here to turn this room off. In the summertime, we'll take the roof down and just let it grow like normal and not pay to do it. So put the, the switch there. And I would want the heater to be on the this side of the switch. So let's temperature heater right. Got to make sure, though, that it grabs power. Let me look at the sun lamp again. Furniture. Okay. Right there. So I'll move over one space. So I do have two spaces available. Okay. So temperature heater. Not there, but there. That way is a much better chance I'm going to be able to force it to go here instead of grab the maybe this side of the switch or something and then never be able to turn it off. Well, you can turn each individual device off too. So every device has a way to turn it on and off and then you can switch an entire circuit on and off. So it's a lot easier if you have several things to turn off just to put a switch in line and then you can, you know, one command and it's done. All right, this is done here. 
let's before handy gets away floors wooden floor let's wooden floor at this end and let's move uh day lilies no do that one so two clicks reinstall in all four corners no reinstall there reinstall two clicks there and those can be in the other corners there and there all right so let's put together a quick little wedding chapel out of this room before we have to use it for for guests or for for colonists put it that way um, miscellaneous I guess handy can get to actually you want to build the roof all right well let you build the roof Justin before I forget did you stay you did okay so there's already a hundred and five I think is what it is steel and there's another chunk of steel over here Sun lamp took how much it took 25 and the heater took 65 these have not been built so there's already enough to do it oh so many things I want to get done at the same time but really the the herbal medicine is the highest priority let's have you get that one going bring enough to do that well you're just gonna grab the 35 okay anyway so this over here the door would be right there right yeah that's a door and with that the pathway to it is right here which means we got to get you guys moved hmm okay so we need a I'm gonna wake everybody up doing this I need a door there we need a wall wood shot through here this is all sealed once the roof goes in I can take this wall out and we'll we'll start to get to work on that okay so, everything I need to make this function is installed and will be queued up shortly once I get handy to get more steel, a second run. In fact, before Justin leaves this area, a group of travelers passing by. Um, before Justin leaves, I want to make sure she hauls a load in. Any chance you guys are more than just travelers? No. So, we're not going to be able to trade with them. We could... Uh, what's the what's the word? Not kidnap, but um, Shanghai is that a was that a, a phrase that, a word that would work? We could uh, kidnap them and make them you know, imprison imprison them and convert them to our colony. Getting the Rana of the River really angry with us. In fact, it seems like that goes straight to like negative eighty five. So right there we'd have. One less person to do any trading with, so I won't do that. But careful shooter, though white is a wimp, and uh, but is well good at melee, decent at shooting, and good at growing, <clears throat> and capable of caring though. And Bren, male, <clears throat> pretty good character here. Pyromaniac though, depressive, and super immune. Depressive stacked with a pyromaniac. I don't think I'd want to have anything to do with that willingly. You know, we'll we'll get people who will just out of nowhere join the colony. Oh, I hate when you do that. You jump down to grab a meal. Let's let's just have you haul the meal in and grab another one over and sit by a table. But Otherwise, I wanted to get you to haul this in. Justin, right there. You gotcha. Thought you were getting away, didn't you? Haul a stack of these in, please. Great. Now, let's get her to go back to there later. Cathra, you are hauling squirrel. Oh, you're going to make the long run. You know, those aren't really worth it. Not what it's going to take. I didn't think about that as I did that. Let's forbid you. And the other was up here, or have we already made that long run once? The other, you are squirrel. Can I see? Dead. Zoom out. It's the only dead. So we've already made the trip once. Cathra, let's pass on that. Hauling marble blocks to stockpile. So you're in hauling mode. Okay. 
Is there anything else I could have you do? Like, you know, haul... Oh, this wood's already been here. Let's have you, you know, theoretically haul wood to this wall. A.K.A. build wall. Though you may not actually build it. Tomislav's filling this in. Great. Getting a roof on. <clears throat> okay, handy. You are consuming a fine meal still. Okay, we'll get that done. Then I want you... I could have Tomislav carry all the iron in. Yeah, we'll do that. <clears throat> Otherwise, i got to shut this down soon. Well, we got the goal done of getting this sealed and ready to go. We're about to get power to it. In fact, Handy, you are building a roof. Could I have you? Don't have... That is so strange how that works. Although, has Justin set the steel down? Tomislav's going that way. That's not Justin. Right there. As soon as Justin does that. Now. Although I probably have to wait for two or three seconds before the game's going to register it. huh? Alright, we'll wait. Now. Can I have you reserved by Tomislav? So you've reserved all of that. Okay. We'll let Tomislav do his thing. And let's see how much he actually brings in. Michael managed to find himself one more granite stone. Okay. So, Manny's filling in the roof. She is filling in these last pieces here. <clears throat> and Thomas, I've got 75. Great. Got the whole load. Otherwise, glancing over at my clock. Need to turn this episode off. Hate to turn it off. Enjoy the game too much to turn it off. There's always... A dozen other little things that could be done. That's got to get done. Need to get somebody back on cleaning mode. How are the meals now? 42. So Shantico's almost done. Shantico's sleeping. With hitting his, his cap of 50, then he'll be back on cleaning duty. Which works out pretty good. What did the beauty do to this room? I want to check that out. What's that made out of, anyway? That is... I don't get a sense of it here. So materials aren't there. Got to go here. You are made of... Why can't I see it? I'm, I'm sure it's marble. But there's no marble listed there. There's no marble listed... There it is, marble, the first word. Okay, so that's a marble sculpture. But, beauty, 1.6. That's probably the most beautiful room in the entire colony. Certainly more beautiful than the storage room. Good. Now, if we can get more sculptures going. Question is, do I just tell Catherine to do that for a while? Or do we continue to get other things accomplished? Hmm. What is Catherine primarily doing? <clears throat> right, you're at the top. Primarily it was art and then haul. And these things have been sitting here for so long and the hauling still hasn't been done. So, really, that Sangria doing more training... Which means we probably want to eliminate the taming on some of these. Just concentrate on these three left. That's all? Yeah, nothing else is scattered around here. And then she can concentrate on training the, uh, the haulers. Which, unfortunately, is at the very end of the uh, training of the list. So she won't get to hauling until she's done all the other ones. Hmm. Well, is it time to shut this down? Just a matter of waiting for Thomas Slav to... Did he get distracted? Hauling components to heater. No, he did deliver it all. Okay. And Handy is going to actually get it built. Tell you what. I can hear a rabbit shooting up there. Let's wait just long enough... <laughs> for Handy to not... Do the job. Do I have to do this manually every time? I do. All right, do that, and then shift click or shift and do that, 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 and do that. I don't know what just happened there. You need to get more steel or something. All right, cancel all that and do what you like. All right, Tomislav was going to bring more components, but he's tending to Klaus. Oh, it's medicine time. Ah, 
So, in that case, Tomislav Health, I guess I need to set you to self-tend. So you can apply your own medicine, because Natalia's asleep. Okay. Well, with that then, I think we'll call this done. Let's see one run here of how this works. There's the specs. Nothing changes other than we'll be tending again in one day in 23 hours. So it's every other day. Yeah. So we'll call this one finished here. It's been Noble Rambler. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll catch you next time. Bye-bye. Thank mm -hmm. you.